Hey guys, welcome back to Skyden, and we're here in the Labyrinthian Chasm trying to find a stack of Magnus. We got started a bit of Labyrinthian, but it was running out of time, so I had to just stop prematurely. Um, so let's go through this door here. It just leads to a similar section. If you, it has two, generally two ways, and they just lead to about the same area. So if you came from a different direction, you'd end up down here. Oh, what's this? Search Argonian, who's got a tail still moving. Um, obvious what happened there, but we'll just search this chest for some gold and a coin purse. So good. I actually didn't realise it was there. It's the first time I've been trying to find things like that. Um, never mind. And um, if you come from the other direction, you come from that way and down. Oh, look, I was that close to the door. Oh, I forgot. I could have just went to the door if I realised. Nope, we're not Aaron, but you'll find that out sooner or later. I could have just come all the way down to the door and just said, bye. Right, so, Labyrinth and Fallerfair. I think I said that wrong, but never mind. And based on the fact that that section was actually shorter than I remembered it, we might get to where I want to be much quicker than I was expecting. Now, so let's get this first person to be back again. I tend to not like first person because if I'm moving around a lot, it kind of makes me dizzy, I don't know why. I think it's just because of the high frame rate stuff, it just makes me a bit off. I don't know how to describe it, but it's like that. Oh, petty soldier, good. Okay, there's several ways to go here. I believe this one just leads to the same area, but it just leads to some loot that you can't get to. Uh, so we'll go through here because it's just easier. It's a novice locked door anyway, so not going to be difficult to find whatsoever. Or do much damage to a lot of picking skill. Let's go down here. That just means to nothing at all. So over here is a couple of chests. Quite a few chests of gold and lock picks, that's good. Gold, more lock picks. Scroll of Conjure Radak calls Radak Stung and Thumbs back to Nern for 100 says, Who is that? Comment below if you know who he is. He wields alteration magic and deals bonus damage to tele telekinetically suspended opponents. Um, I really have to test that one because I've never heard of that guy. He might be just made up. But if you if it does exist, let me know in the comments because I'm interested. Do you I don't know, but we'll find it. So you'll come to here and you'll have to fall off. Um, if you come the other way, you just come down from this bit here, so let's see. Oh, a skeleton. There I go, down. I don't think there's anything else up here, is there? Yeah, you'll come from the other bit around this bit if you go the other way, but never mind. That bit leads to some loot so that you can't get it off because we're going to have to play a troll. If they are, it's not going to be helpful. Is it a troll? Yeah, it's a troll. Okay, fine. Help me, Lydia. I've got to say, that's pretty tough. Oh, that was... Thank you very much. Trolls are not so difficult for me now. Why am I complaining? Now we're going to bother picking up any of that. Now, over here is some um, loot a little hidden away bit here. No, I don't think I need to duck. Spellbind a runic armor, that's from the whatever it is, the immersive armors. She loves using that staff thing, doesn't she? A skeleton. Um, around here there should be maybe another chest. I can't remember. There's an urn. I suppose I'll just take that. And down this side bit here. So whoever this voice is, um, was related to Aaron at some point, you know, the archer had just died. So I wonder what it's about. He must have come, he came here, tried to do something and failed at whatever it was he was trying to do. Um, oh for shit's sake, what's with these skeletons? This place is riddled with skeletons, it's not so much Draugr. Yeah, 
Yes! But... I'm not at him, but he's not sent me in his place because he's dead. Die. Oh, there's a gold vein here. There's quite a few gold veins here, I have to, to say. And, and Labyrinth vein. I don't know why, but never mind. Oh, shadow glitch. Oh, for God's sake, go away. Right, if you come over this bridge, you'll actually lead to a little secret area with another troll. Um, there's a lot of blood, I think. Oh, for God's sake, that was a pretty terrible hit. Oh, damn, I've got to have it up. Help. I'm trying to prevent him from killing me. Oh, that was close. Got a double heal. Oh, stop the freezing, it's annoying. Well, the Shadow Play doesn't give me much of a frame rate counter, so it's hard to tell if I'm getting frame rate drops because it's so slow to update, but never mind. So come through this bit here. It just leads to a dead end with loot, so don't worry. Another troll, for God's sake. Come on, Lydia, get in there. Lydia, I want you to go in here, please. God's sake, he's close to me. Damn it. Lydia, get in. Please. They're not gonna go in. If you're not, then fine. But still, I prefer that you just went in. Oh god, that was close. Double heal. Uh, an amethyst ring on him, that's good. Blood soaked urn. And a chest, how interesting. The gold, I'm only looting chests for gold, I'm not really interested in the other stuff. So that's just a dead end that leads to there. Somehow Lydia will not come with me, I don't know why, but never mind. Let's progress. Why do I have that, um, the compass up? What that, I might, I don't know. I don't even know why I'm bothering. I suppose I got a potion into this. I suppose that helps. More gold. Graduation's up to 80. Uh, interesting. That's that's good to know. I can get the Oblivion Binding perk now. Um, so when I get to the next level, level 26, put the last perk into Oblivion Binding, and that's it. I'm not even going to go with the Twin Souls yet because I'm trying to go up either this this and then that, or I'd have to get this one and then go over and I need to get 90 for that anyway so Oblivion by is the next pack I'm putting in and after that I'm just going to diverge into our skill trees, probably the destruction because I've barely got skill there. I mean the only pack I've got in destruction is the dual casting one that doesn't even count. Uh, let's go around here because there's another skeleton. One hit death, good. Up here is a uh, potent magic poison, how interesting. Loot. Don't think there's anything over here, no. God, this is getting pretty dark. Actually, hang on. Dual cast. Go. And let's get it. Oh dear, a wisp mother. Um, you've never met wisp mothers yet in the Let's Play, they're really annoying. They're very strong, I have to say. Uh, these things are wisps that are related to the wisp mother. Dead. They're, they're very easy to kill these wisps, so don't worry. Wait, look at that. One hit and it's dead. If we can kill off the wisps, that'll help because then that prevents her from surviving. It's like a kind of a witch thing. Oh, for God's sake, it was close. Are you going to come and help or not? They're very, very strong, these things, I have to point out. Yeah, well, I'll need some um, stamina first. Not that, um, that. And then she makes clones called Shades, 
It's so very annoying, I have to point out. And she's almost dead. At least she's now dead. That was too difficult, I have to point out. Good. How's Lydia going? Oh, she's stuck. Okay, fine. Let's just try and... What's the hurry? The hurry is to try and get you out of that trapped space. You managed to get yourself into... Hang on. There we go. Okay, ash pile. Absolutely nothing worth on now. So I'm not even going to bother looting the wrist mothers. They don't have anything worth having. Um, they're just, they're just ash piles that they just um, have wisp wrappings on it. Things for alchemy. But other than that, useless. I think down here there is a... Chest is there? No, it just leads to nothing at all. Okay. And let's see, let's just get on with it. No, I didn't say anything about that. Right, so all I said is fire, and just as you can see, if you don't have frostbite, you can already have it here. But I don't understand the point of putting these here at all because you have to have fire, uh, you have to have frostbite for the previous quest, which makes so little sense. There's a couple of ice spike ones if you want to use them instead. Frostbite. Oh, fire spirit. Which died like so easily. I mean, come on, I mean, that was just ridiculous. Yeah, but I don't understand the point of a frostbite book there when you have to have one. You have to have the book anyway. I mean, it's just stupid. Right, this just dead is with some urns. Why am I even bothering? Why am I even bothering? I mean, I said I wasn't going to loot anymore, but I'm looting it anyway. Oh! Come on! We can't stop now. We have to keep moving. Where's Avery? She was right behind me. Dead. Something grabbed her from behind. Gone before I could do anything. This is an insanity. Whatever I should have come. You're right. This is all my fault. Should we turn around, head back? I don't think going back is a good idea. Going back would be the end of all of us. We keep pushing forward and we'll make it. We will. Okay, fine. So this is all Savos' fault then, basically. I was trying to ignore the fact that I'm getting shot at by skeletons while that speech happened. Oh. Oh, for God's sake. Um, yeah, I will point out that by this point you will have to deal with um, special kind of Draugr which um, look like ghosts. And they have Drainheart swords. I'm not even going to bother picking them up because they're useless. I forgot to say there was a big freeze up. Close this trapdoor if I can. There's spectral warhounds. I don't think they'll even have anything. It looks so stupid seeing a ghost. Like that, I mean, it really is so stupid. And let's see, can I get this out? I know a flame match track is hardly the best thing to be using, but so what? Cycle round. Oh, Draugr White with the Drainheart Sword, how interesting. And the Drainheart Sword does take away your stamina. Just be aware of that. And she'll deal with that, fine. The Great Soldier now, good for me. Oh, shit, didn't mean to do that. Oh, a skeleton. And help a couple of dead bodies, apparently. Why did I pick up Nightshade? Didn't want that. Right, Lydia, get your arse down here. You're just going to stand up there. A gold ingot if you want it. And there a bit of random thing. There's even a drain spell bow. Which is interesting, for God's sake, God, no! And I've just gone the wrong way almost. 
Help. Please. Look at that down there. This will help, I suppose. Kind of arrows the nose that she's got. Um, interesting. The rest are stronger, that's the one I've already seen. Why don't you just stay in there? Come on. Come on, Lydia, get down there. Ah, there she is. There's one of them. Well, I suppose that helps, and it's just helped me to regenerate all of my lost um, magic and such. Die, please. Don't even try. And you're dead. Easy enough. Oops. Another gold. Why am I even bothering again? There's, oh, there's farmer arrows. That's what she's got. Okay, fine. Another gold. And if you fell through the trap door above, I completely ignore it. But if you fall through the trap door, you just come down straight here. So you just skip a big bunch of it. But of course, you'll probably get killed by the attack that you'll come under. A troll. We have nothing on it. I think we're going to loot the arts because it's getting boring now. Just see the labyrinth thing is long, so I suppose this is just proving my point. Um, ah, here we go. Labyrinthian Tribune. And here we are. I think there's a word wall in here, if I remember remembering it right. Uh, there's a word wall for slow time. I like how the drain heart ones are just standing in plain view for me to just notice. Dead. Pfft. Two hits, two or three hits, and they're all dead. Fine. Don't even bother. Just close that door so no, no one else comes through. Yeah, they take away all your stamina. Oh. Steadfast ward, that's actually useful if you want to use wards. So I'll take it anyway. Um, not like I'm going to use it. Yeah, we're in the last room now. Yeah, this last room has a word wall for slow time, and you must be obviously on this quest to get that particular one. Let's see, what's this steadfast ward? Could conscious a divine shield with 22 armor that they can that can negate up to 60 points of spell damage or effects when blocking. Um, yeah, I forgot to mention that some of the ward spells, particularly the steadfast ward, with is it Apocalypse or no, it's Spark? Um, they get changed to actual proper shields, but I'm not actually going to use it because I'm not interested in blocking whatsoever. Um, probably best to take a quick save here because you might get killed. Oh, there's a. Oh, for God's sake. Take that for shit. This was annoying, I had to point out. I'll take the iron ingots and take out the two potions. And then I'll just leave that like that. Let's see, light is what I need. And let's see, where's the fireball? I think that's my quick axe has been using it. Yep. Yeah. I just said everything flying. Oh dear, this is difficult. I hope I don't get under attack anytime soon. Uh, and you say that just stopped working because they so they made themselves uh, blow off when they hit themselves. That's stupid. I'll trade it up to level 57. Perfect. Her duration is up to 81. Nearly at the next level. That's actually really good how I'm leveling. That more drain heart based Draugr. Spectral Draugr, I would say. Okay, he fell down. Good. Earn. A Draugr who's going to die fairly easily to my sword. Actually, I'll just take that gold. Don't think I'll reach the end of Labyrinthian in this part. By the way, I'm looking at the time. 130 golds on that chest, take it. Uh, a couple of chests. Scroll of Death March, I'll look at that later. There's a torch in there if you need it, but obviously, you should be made, you won't need those things. I am avoiding a lot of the battle, I know. The rest is stronger. 
why am I even bothering with the did get the the solar type. Never mind. I think is there something above us or am I thinking about a different section? Might be a different section, because it just seems awfully deep here for some reason. There's some malachite ore if you want to take it. There's some gold ore as well. That's a fallen in from above. I assume. But I'm not interested because we're just going to continue on. Oh no. Dual cast. There. Yeah, that'll keep happening for this, uh, this last part, but nothing to worry about. Uh, over here is a adept level gate, which we're just going to go ahead and unlock. I think what I'll do is I'll try and reach up to the um, the word wall, and then we'll stop there. Oh shit! Can't get this lock picked at all. There we go. Oh, uh, ancient helmet of the unburned and honed ancient Nord great sort of sword of scorching. I'll just take both of that, just to chuck it. Potion of Mind of Magic, I'll take that even though I don't really need it anymore. Let's see, so what's these enchants like on these two bits of armor I'm never going to use? Fire is by 40. Uh, let's just save as that, I'm just going to drop that. Burst attack of 50, I've got that, don't care. Let's see, let's continue. The word wall is just up ahead anyway, so... I think we're just about to end this part. Yep, I don't think you can see it, but it's just there. Right, so we'll take a quick save. Hopefully my two associates, aka Lydia and a flame match, that can help me get their arse through here. Where the hell are they? Have they got stuck in the water? Right, um, hang on a sec, we're going to have to use console commands to get her out of there. Yet again, I'm proven wrong because Lydia just happens to move herself out of the situation. Lydia, please stop getting stuck, force me to have to stop for cause commands and then have to uh, turn around and just notice that you're there. Right, so, let's do a proper quick save. Let's go forward. And there's a Draugr Death Lord in deceit. Oh, a leveled Draugr. Oh, fuck! Oh, for God's sake, die, Spectral Warhound, I don't care for you. It's a shame I can't conjure two action acts, I would have just put two out. I'll get the word in a second. Holy Christ of Uncles. <laughs> that is a strange word I just used there, I just made that up on the spot, but fuck Christ that damage, that was ridiculous. And I've got the level, so that's good enough for me. I'll just spend the part shortly at the end of this video, I think. This Draugr will go down in a second. That is not the boss though, we're not at the end of this level, not by a long shot. All that for 80 gold, a waste of time. I'll just wait for the music to end. Let's see the glitchy stairs, I think they're just a bit steeper than they should be. Let's see. Okay, let's get this word wall and be done with this. Black to screen as always. Time, slow time, not even gonna use that shout. Um, I think we'll leave it there for this video, but I'll level up in a tick when the music shuts up because I prefer to make sure audio cues work properly. Right, so we've done our magic cut, we're just gonna stack health a lot now. Got the perk. Obli oh, shit. Oblivion by by weapons do even more damage again. Elemental enchantments, how interesting. There we go. What kind of um, enchant does this now have? Let's see. Does it have any enchantments at all or is it just useless? Let's see Oblivion Sword. Yeah, so Oblivion Sword, Crazy Magic Sword for 7 minutes. Uh, 7 minutes and 13 seconds to be precise. Um, I don't think it says anything here about it, but never mind. Right, that's this video over with. In the next part, we're going to head further on and find out what the hell's going on here. Because that's our time. Bye, so watching, and we'll see you in the next part. Bye now.